coffee day two cup one foxy loxy so the gingerbread house right next to foxy loxy so she said of all of her coffee drinks not the matcha though this was well, her best yeah because that's not a coffee drink. yeah so as I said, this, the, the taste with this one is the most unique. It's smooth, it's rich, it's strong, which is nice. It has a decent aftertaste, kind of like a reminder of Ethiopian. I guess I don't need to be wearing no. Alright, Bonaventure. We parked outside, because I, I mean, we probably could park inside, but there is a little gate there. So, our theory is... Well, it's not our theory, so it's a thing. So apparently if you have good vibes and you bring a gift for Gracie, who's like one of the famous tombs in here because she's a little girl, then she'll lead you to her grave. So they say not to look at any maps, don't look up where she is, and just kind of like wander and see if you find her. So if you have good vibes, you're supposed to be led to her, and if you have bad vibes, you end up right back at the entrance again. So we'll see if we're back here or not. The runner just up ahead running. Park near the giant pyramid head. Thank you, Silent Hill. It's very pretty in there. It's peaceful. Especially now that the uh, digger is gone. The backhoe digger. ones that you can't see. I think he must be like one of these. Because this was one of the ones that they had over there and they had the birth and the death. 11 years old. This is what they did. 77, 88, 1800s. There's my triangle one. So, I mean, I was semi-close where I was going. If this is her. Yeah, all the toys. So, I mean, we... I guess we have semi-good intentions. Yeah. We're confused by this. Why do you have a... I guess we have to go read the sign now. Old damage. So, waterworks and garden. So, this used to be a garden. Then, in 1905, following an explosion of one of these pipes. I'm confused by the starfish. Life in World War. 
So it is kind of interesting how it's like sections. Yeah. Because these are all, all mostly Greek. It's pretty lane going down. I can tell we're back close to the road. You hear all the cars. Jewish side of the cemetery. And this is the non Jewish. That explain why we saw all of them over here. Back at our pyramid head. So what I'd definitely say is get to places early in Savannah. Because it gets busy and tours. And we got here, it was, I mean, one other couple was here with us. It was empty. And this parking lot was empty as you guys kind of saw. And now it means car after car after car and tour after tour after tour. It's just, it's very busy. Hmm? So I was very cool. I'm glad we got here early. Really? Yeah. When there was like no Yes. And it's kind of what I'm feeling like Savannah. You want to get out before places are open to see around you. I also would wear shoes because it's very uh, dusty and muddy. And like, I wore sandals and look at them. Yes. <laughs> I just wiped my feet off on the grass because the grit is... Well, I wore my shoes today. So I got a pricker. <sighs> Ow. I should have worn my boots. Yeah, oh, come on. There it goes. I never asked you, cemetery impressions. I mean, the cemetery. I liked it. I thought it was really cool. I mean, learned a lot about Jewish cemeteries. Well, not necessarily Jewish cemeteries, but Jewish traditions. Like, I had no idea the pebble thing. Yeah, and they were everywhere. We're heading to get lunch, but this is pretty cool. I give them props for having a dragon outside. And fun music. We made it onto the dot. Our first experience with that. Uh, we waited about 10 minutes, a little under four. Which means we probably just missed it. So there goes the dot. That was nice. It was quicker, even with probably waiting the 10 minutes. Wind has arrived. It's cooled down. You can see your breath. Not quite. But spooky day continues at our second cemetery. Ooh. Don't make fun of me. You're the one with ghost earrings. No. What? I don't want you Sorry. No good for her. So all it took was one full day together and I'm being yelled at and she's done with me. No. I mean, there's no words on them, at least facing us. I mean, even a monument like this where it's just faded. So would he be considered a founding father? If he signed the Declaration of Independence, yeah. So the song lied. What? Not every other founding father got to grow old. Not every other founding father got to have their story told. Well, I don't know how old he was when... In 35 to 77. But, well... Before coming here, I talked to a bunch of people. Some of them who either lived in Savannah at one point or went to SCAD. And, like, their whole thing was like, yeah, I love Savannah, except for, like... It has a low vibration. There's like parts of it that just feel not good. And that, that city market and anything west of, because from Leopold over there, we haven't had any issue. I mean, minus no. lines. So and we avoided it all yesterday. It was yeah. like yesterday, I was even thinking about it. It's like, I don't feel that way at all. Like, I feel pretty good. Like, I feel. Like, yeah, there's some nasty, like, history. But for the most part, like, I didn't feel anything, like, heavy. But just, just even just walking through that, like, I just feel... And when it was people drunk and people who just stay at bars and drink. And it was, it's a different scene. It's Not the party scene. scene. No. <laughs> at all. You guys ready to see? It's normal. It's a plant. It's a horror show. 
It's unexpected is what it is. And we're out for the ghost tour. Although we have like an hour till the ghost tour. So we're just kind of wandering. These are the real deal. These were actually in the Revolutionary War and they made a lot of British coasts. Uh, and they're in good shape too for how old they are. They actually look pretty good. It's close to 11, a little after 11 o'clock. Walking through Forsyth, and we still have a pupper out there because no trip through Forsyth is well good without a pupper. Hello. I don't know how much you guys can see us, but we are talking about the ghost tour. And we're mixed on it. I mean, I'm not sure that any of them are any good. Yes. But some put a little more oomph into it. Well, I mean, whatever the one with the trolley where they were actually like going into the house, that would be cool because you get to go into the house play. Yes. But yeah, they went into the Davenport house. We are we are ending our our tour and it was they were going into the Davenport house off a, a haunted tour trolley bus thing. We're coming into life. So, it is interesting. Yesterday was a great day. It felt like everything was a hit and it worked and it wasn't too crowded and even the rain worked. Today, the the cemetery getting there early was great. Even the cemetery here was very interesting. A lot of interesting like markers and yeah. City market though kind of broke the rhythm that we've been having. Yeah, everything since then has felt just kind of off. Yeah. Because I won't say don't do a ghost tour at Savannah, do a ghost tour. But like, maybe do one of the ones that costs a bit more and like you actually get to ride on a thing and like, I don't know, if it says that you actually get to go into a building. Yeah, I mean do research and see what they actually... Yeah, like the hearse ones, the gimmick is that you get to ride around in a hearse. Yes. I wouldn't say it was bad, it was just nothing new and... It, it was, okay. it was lacking. I yeah. agree. It was just, it was lacking. Having a fox and fig on an empty Sunday morning. Free parking though, so we decided to walk. Hey guys, other camera today. Hopefully the battery doesn't run out, but we have the car so I can go back and get it. Fox and fig, one of the big ones everyone said to go for vegan. I liked it, I got the proper breakfast. The menu is very limited. Yeah. So well, if you're in some of the things that like I saw online that I was kind of excited about, which I don't remember what they were, I just know they weren't on the menu anymore. So I don't know if it changes or what it is, but Well, I think they also used to have like a couple specials every day, and I think that with COVID they're just not doing that. Might be the case. But I I mean it was good. If you need something, it was busy. Like it's definitely a place that locals go to, because yeah. it was. I mean, busy. the the picnic spread that's on the menu does sound really good. That would probably be what I would have gotten, other than the burger. But it was seventeen dollars and probably way more food than I could eat by myself. And Joe yeah. was getting his own breakfast, and I kind of wanted something warm, and that was going to be like hummus and tapenade and like cheeses, yeah, and, and spreads and whatnot, which is fine. Would be good for like a day or you just want to go to Forsyth and sit down and Yeah, hang to grab it and then take it and go. But it was good. I I say if you need vegan, it's definitely there and it's it's good. The coffee was good. I actually like the coffee that better than Foxy Loxy. And I don't I don't know because it was just fresh, because they literally made it like her her coffee came, or her Latte. drink came out first before mine because they had to break a, a make a brand new pot. So I got fresh coffee, which is great. All right, going to do the Savannah 40 thing, or that's the SCAD 40 thing, uh, and just kind of hang out. Figure out what the rest of today is gonna to be like. Today's really our relaxing day. We really don't have any hard plans. Other than SCAD. Yeah, which we made yesterday. Yeah. Originally we had absolutely no plans for today. Back. The camera's back, has a new battery in it. I just wanted to cover a few things. 
Dinner tonight was a flying monk. Very, very good. They did have the ability to make most things vegan. I had the, the Singapore noodles. Very, very good. Like, so highly recommend. The Owens house, it was a very somber tour. The, the house focused on what the rooms were for and really how the enslaved worked and lived in the house and not so much on the Owens themselves. I mean, there's a little bit, but it, it didn't focus on them overall. So that was, it was a nice focus and I think it was done respectfully and, but that's it for today. It's been a fun weekend. Our feet are very tired from all the walking. So it, it, was, a, it was a good trip. It was a very good trip. I think that's all I have for now.